Happy ploughing day. It is a public holiday in Thailand. I've had two days of school and then Wednesday is a public holiday, a ploughing day, so we get the day off, which is nice. I didn't know that, so I haven't really had time to plan anything. But what we're gonna do, we're gonna catch this boat on the Mekong and go on the other side and just check out what's on the other side. We've got some sort of palace here. I think there's some nice cafes and restaurants, so that's what we're gonna do today. Enjoy the day off. Let's do it. So you see from across the water, let's have a look. It looks all locked up, so you can't go in. Maybe it's someone's house, a mansion maybe. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Some government officials, I don't know. Looks very cool and very nice buildings. Beautiful cafe here. I'm going to drink this coffee and I'm going to show you around this cafe while you drink it. Um, it's very peaceful, very nice. A lot of little knickknacks and things, Instagram places. I got a hazelnut coffee, uh, 120 baht. Um, a bit of a walk from the port. It would be great to get a bike. On my to do list is to find a bike to, that I can rent or buy. That's on the to do list. It would be much better to get around. Um, but I'm in no rush to do that. Uh, it would be nice to have a bike, even if you can put the bike onto that ferry and then drive around here. Um, that would be cool. So that's all I to do. So I'm going to drink this coffee. Sorry for the f noise of the fan. And you guys, I'm going to show you around this cafe.
That was amazing. Very good. The coffee was delicious. There's a lot of different types of coffees. Um, they seem to be very uh, different quality coffees from around the world. Uh, different blends. So definitely recommend it. I don't know what would bring you to this area. I'll put it on the in the information where it was. But if I was in this area more often, I'd definitely use that as a local. Very good. Now I'm going to walk. It's a bit hot. It's now 10.30. Right, temple cool. It's very nice the details inside on the roof and not in the thing. Still new to temples and uh, finding the details that I'm going to be looking for, but I enjoyed it. It's good. Now we're going to head to lunch. Let's go to lunch. Um, it's going to be about 15 minutes the opposite way from the port from the cafe. So we'll head there now. I think it opens at 11. Let's get some food. I think it's going to be some seafood. So that should be good. Let's go. from the wharf that's where we've got that's our boat there the temple all right lunch has arrived this is a uh, squid and salted egg and then we've got like a pad thai seafood pad thai i think and some rice. Let's try the squid. Bon appetit. Mm. And on the pad thai is like um, shrimp. Shrimp. Right, I enjoy this. Lovely view. Happy plowing day. Let's keep them. I think they do some functions here. Maybe you can stay. Maybe that's a bit of a hotel. Very nice spot. Again, I could happily get there before you know the price is a little bit higher all that the drink the pad thai and the squid was 455 baht um, but it was good um, now we're going to keep heading north up the peninsula and find the bridge it's getting close to the middle of the day quarter to 12 and that might do us i think we had a good exercise explore this side of the um, across the island from where I'm living. Yeah, so let's have a look, see what we find. One more temple. This one's, wow, very, oh my gosh. Put the name of this one on the screen. Temples in Thailand are still new to me, so they're still very cool. Alright, so almost time to finish this video. I'm gonna walk across this bridge. It's getting very hot. You guys relax and I'll do the stairs to get up there. See you there. All right. Good walking, well done. You got on top of the bridge. Right, that's where we started. We crossed the water. 
explore this area a bit further this way is the markets the water markets floating markets i'm gonna just head back towards my place uh, it was a good morning the cafe was just what i wanted uh, what i thought would be very beautiful good coffee it'd be nice to go there a bit more often and the restaurant was great good seafood you could go there at night time it looks really nice at night time or when the sun's setting but yeah it was good exploring i enjoyed that very hard i wish i had a bike that is on the to-do list i might have to get a paycheck first before i can afford to buy a bike maybe i can rent a bike per day or somewhere somewhere maybe the hotel's got a bike i could rent just for a day so i can explore but overall can't complain beautiful weather haven't experienced the rainy season yet which is good because i haven't got any rain gear but i had a good morning all right i'm gonna go back and enjoy the air conditioning and i'll see you next time bye